after this thing. very very important important uh news story from naughty dog that no one else has covered by the way oh right. so uh, we gotta have this title then yeah i'm gonna title this because uh this is Everybody annoying me. brace yourself yeah this is annoying me that no one else Everybody is covering this and it's really big for the future of naughty dog right a message okay. this if is you're on... if you're wearing a hat th this is a... if you're wearing a hat so take it the fuck i'm wearing off, a headset right? Do I take it off? Take it off. <laughs> no. No, because you don't be able to hear me then. Uh, oh, yeah, true. Okay. So, so the co-president of Naughty Dog, I'm sorry I can never pronounce his name, Christoph Bellestra, I guess that's how you pronounce it, um, has posted a blog on Naughty Dog's website uh, saying, a message from co-president Christoph Bellestra. Uh, and this is, yeah, I'm just going to read you some of, the, some of the blog here. Um, I never thought I would, be, I, I would be saying something this difficult so soon. After 15 years... I'm announcing my departure from Naughty Dog. My last day will be on April 3rd, 2017. That hit me hard. Because, uh, do you, are you people, are you people, are you familiar with, uh, with Christoph and his work? Um, not intimately, but I'm sure if you mentioned it, I'd be like, yeah. Well, he's the co-president of Naughty Dog, so anything Naughty Dog have done, he's been there since Jason Rubin and Andy Gavin left. Evan Wells and Christoph Bellistra have been the main top honchos of Naughty Dog, and everything that everything has been certified and gone by them before it has been like given the green light. So, mm -hmm. on all the Uncharted and all the Last of Us, these labs oversaw it all. I mean, th yeah, 15 years, that's since, yeah. you know, 2002, that's all... Is that through the Jack? Is that through he's, Jack? Uh... He's been with Naughty Dog. Um, I don't think. He, no, no, he, that was directly after Jack. I think. Mm, okay. Yeah. I think. Yeah, that so would have been directly been in the game after Jack. For a while. But yeah, uh, joining Naughty Dog in 2002 was the biggest decision for my family and my career. I was excited to join the team that created Crash Bandicoot and Jack and Daxter. So yeah, he obviously didn't work on Jack and Daxter. For me, the biggest appeal was working with the with the team responsible for the games I love to play, ones that also looked stunning and were technically ahead of their time. I would have never guessed why what my future at Naughty Dog would look like and when I joined the studio as a programmer. Uh, and then he thanks all the fans and says uh, Naughty Dog will continue to blow you away and he's going on to do bigger and better things. So yeah, uh, quite sad I think because uh, Naughty Dog have never have not missed a beat uh, with the transition from Andy Gavin and Jason Rubin to Christoph and um, what's the other guy's name? Evan Wells. So what does this mean for the uh, for the company and for the games that they're going to be releasing? The, are they are they making another Uncharted game? No, I, they're making DLC for Uncharted. They haven't announced any new Uncharted games, which are making The Last of Us Two, obviously. So that's mm -hmm. all that's been announced so far. <laughs> and Jack Four. <laughs> 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Um, yeah. But yeah, I don't know if they're going to need to nominate a new co-president or if if Evan Wells is going to be the president from here on out. Uh, it's gonna be interesting to see, but I just wanted to that, get that out there because no one else has covered this. It annoyed me. So yeah, that's pretty much that. Uh, if no one else has anything to do, I think we should move on to our next segment. <laughs> 